Hey, welcome back. It's Friday, and it's Friday the 13th, which is considered to be bad luck by some people, but it is a kind of rare occurrence, so it's worth noting. Since Friday the 13th is associated with luck, and because it's Poetry Friday, I'm going to read you a poem about luck. This poem is entitled For Luck, and it's by Eric Pankey, and it was published in Poetry Magazine in 1988, September. For Jose Del Val. You know for sure you are lucky. Luck fills you like the shape of your breath. Then one day as you are reading it leaves. It lifts up like the shadow of wings with the clean ease of smoke on a cold day. Your luck is gone. You watch it fly away over the tracks beyond Providence Road until it is out of sight. Your luck is gone. Still, somehow, you must trust tenderness and all its romance, the fine caress the salt on your hands wearing away whatever they touch. Maybe your luck returned. That is not part of the story. If I should die, you said in the prayer, you said each night. If I should die before I wake. Was it this morning you woke and listened again to the bent apple tree, to the wind work the sweet ache of its load, to the wren and the air it shivered through? Luck, like hope, is hollow-boned. Always there is an updraft to carry what it can. What it cannot falls upon your head like a blessing. That's a delightful little poem about luck. Uh, do you hear the little bit of, a, of an allusion to Emily Dickinson there with the, the hope is the thing with feathers, the bird-like hope uh, in Emily, Emily Dickinson? Uh, he talked about luck in the same sort of terms. Anyway, r rather pleasant. And the fact that you don't have to have luck necessarily to have other good things like hope and joy. Anyway, I hope you have a lovely Friday the 13th, which is full of delightful luck and delightful hope and delightful good things. And here's to a 2017 full of poetry and Poetry Friday. You can click on more episodes of Poetry Friday to listen to me read more poems. Or you can subscribe. Have a lovely week. See you next time. Very flavored. Mm -hmm.